Welcome to the fucking metaverse. We knew Guy a little bit just from him contacting us early, like, you know, 21. I can't remember exactly when. Yeah, but, Jan uh, or Feb or something. Yeah, when all this, when suddenly everybody was contacting us and we were like, why does everyone want to talk to us? And then like, oh, because this stuff is getting legit crazy. Um, <laughs> and just stayed in touch with him and, you know, no particular, you know, agenda or anything on either side, I don't think. Uh, he's just kind of a good person to stay in touch with. And, uh, and just over that time, I think, checking in with us he was starting to realize that we were feeling like more and more out of sorts with everything you know that he was like sort of picking up on like we're not sure like if we're suited to this like we're you know this has become something that we don't know how to operate properly anymore you know and we're not sure like we're not yeah. sure about our decisions and we don't feel you know like we're maybe even the best people to know what to do in a given situation like it had changed so much um so rapidly it feels like a long time i don't know if it's the same for you but it feels like five years but it, it, you know that was yeah. six months kind it was of like thing 20 years yeah mm -hmm. it's, yeah it's really crazy so when yeah. i think of something like oh like way back then and yeah. like, that was like eight months ago um so it was really changing rapidly over those months you yeah know? and we did feel like fish out of water you know we had built the stuff and we were proud of it and everything but now the role was a role we weren't suited to you know like community management and marketing and there was a bit unfair to you guys in a lot of ways because the BAYC model was very upfront about what it was. Mm -hmm. That was not the CryptoPunks model. That was yeah. the MeBits model yeah. right? for, for future utility and roadmaps. And I remember seeing you guys catch a lot of like flack and hate for being like, oh, like where's the, where's the, the MeBits world? Like where's the MeBits utility? Where's this? And it's like, well, that was never what, yeah. what, what the value proposition was. That was never what state, you never stated anywhere that you would ever build anything like that. Yeah, we, we definitely felt that we uh, that we were out of our element. It's like, yeah, what did we create? <laughs> you know, like, yeah, and it felt like, like a you know like deep connection to this stuff. Felt it was really interesting and 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 felt a responsibility to do the right thing. And but we weren't sure ever what the right thing was anymore. You know, and we're being told conflicting things. And like, yeah. you just end up feeling like a little bit lost and bad that you're not doing the right thing, but not even clear how to rectify. You know, yeah. so. And we're experimentalists, we're individual contributors, we're not managers, we're not company builders, like, it's not our personality, you know, and uh, so that's where our, that's where we were, you know, when Guy kind of, yeah, yeah came to us and, and, could, and yeah, he could tell, you know, that, that we were, it's like, you guys doing okay, you know, <laughs> and it's like, no. <laughs>